Now to Brevard County tonight, where the woman accused of helping her boyfriend kill a 30-year-old man in the undeveloped community known as the Compound in Palm Bay has pleaded no contest. Renee Lemos was arrested back in September. Investigators say she and her boyfriend were found driving that victim's BMW around. She was later indicted on several charges, including murder. But today, the state and the defense made a deal. News Six's James Barbero has been following this story. He was in the courtroom today. So in what was the most recent of three murder investigations in the compound, Palm Bay police said Robert Lanning and Renee Lemos blamed each other for killing Nick Mitchell. Today's plea hearing didn't tell us more about what really happened, but I did just learn how long Lemos could be going to prison for. Judge Aaron Peacock could now send her to the Department of Corrections for up to 18 years. It sounds like what you wish to do is enter a plea of no contest to the amended charge which is accessory after the fact to a capital felony with the cap of 18 years in prison. Is that what you'd like to do today? Correct. You want to enter into this a plea agreement because you believe it's in your best interest to resolve your case. Is that why you're pleading no Correct. contest? Yes. Last September, Nick Mitchell's roommate told me how the 30-year-old got hurt at work, so he had to wear a heart monitor. Police say that heart monitor pinged the location of Mitchell's body after he was shot. Police said Lanning and Lemos met Mitchell at the Circle K on Malabar Road, and they said he wanted to sell them his car and go drag racing, so they went to the compound. He was a good friend. He was like family. A car enthusiast, too. Nick Bauer told me his roommate would never race his BMW because he took it to shows. Well, he was really a car guy. He loved cars. He wouldn't be out drag racing. I think he got carjacked. As soon as they got the car, they headed out of state with it. Judge Peacock scheduled Lemos' sentencing for August 8th. In February, Lanning took a plea deal in this case, too, and also for an amended charge of accessory after the fact. So that means neither Lanning nor Lemos will be prosecuted for the murder of Mitchell. The state attorney's office in court did not tell us why. If I get an answer by the time of their sentencings, we'll update this story on ClickOrlando.com. In Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting Results News 6.